Today we'll show you transducer mounting for the new Grayline TTFM 1.0 transit time flow meter. You get all the mounting hardware you need with each flow meter. We begin by inserting adjustable clamps through each of the two mounting brackets. The clamp is mounted on the pipe and secured in place by tightening the adjustment screw. Any excess length can be trimmed and discarded. The TTFM flow meter calculates the transducer separation distance for us, so we position the mounting brackets and check with a tape measure or ruler. An alignment bar is included to help position the brackets properly on the pipe. Once the mounting brackets are tightened in place, we're ready to mount the ultrasonic transducers. Coupling compound is applied to the face of each transducer to help conduct sound efficiently into the pipe. Then we insert the transducer into the mounting bracket and secure in place. Compound is applied and the second transducer is mounted and tightened onto the pipe in the same way. To reduce the possibility of electrical interference, we connect grounding straps to each of the two mounting brackets. Now we connect the transducers to the TTFM 1.0 flow meter electronics. The coaxial cables use B and C connectors and couple to the transducer. The B and C connections are protected by seal jackets. These can be filled with coupling compound in wet applications. Here is the completed transducer assembly installed on the pipe. The TTFM 1.0 transit time flow meter is ready to read flow.